hello, hello, hello. Hi, good night, guys. Good night, everybody. How are you? Pretty good? Good night. Good night. How are you guys? Hey, Mr. Rafael Herrera. Hey, great job. everybody. Hey, Yvette, how are you, girl? Jeanette, Mr. Alejandro Plates, Miss Jenny, excellent job. Woohoo! I love your picture, Alejandro. You look so happy there. Yeah, I think. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, very good. Okay. Hey, guys, how was your day today? Was it good? Yeah, it was good. Hey, Mr. Herrera, could you uh, uh, were able to deliver all the merchandise? Yes, I do. Hey, that's I great. Did it. Yeah, I did it. Yeah, excellent. All righty. That was a great day. Woohoo! Great job. Hey, Rachel, finally I can see your beautiful eyes. Very good. Hi. <laughs> I love your curly hair. I like it. Very good. Alex, <laughs> did you invent something new to, to, to cook today? Um, hello. Hello. Um, yeah, I got uh, some recipes, you know. Oh, really? Recipes. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> like, for example, beside the chicken with mushrooms? I have uh, a menu of the pasta. Mm -hmm. Yeah, pasta with the, do you know the, it's an Italian sauce. It's a green sauce. The green sauce? Yeah. I don't pesto, know. Pesto, pesto, pesto. Pesto. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. Okay, guys, take a note. That is for romantic dinners, you know? <laughs> so, Mr. Rafael, you better take notes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I will. <laughs> you will? Okay, very good. I'm so happy to see you one more time, guys. This is the last day of our first week. Can you imagine? Yeah. Wow. Time passed really, really fast. We already ended our first week and you will see guys that uh, in just like, um, I don't know, a few days will be uh, the last day of our class. <laughs> oh. so time passed really fast. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hey Angel, hey guys, by, by next week, we're going to do some activity in a really fun way. We're going to Great. play something that calls Kahoot. Cahoom. Cahoom. No, Cahoom. No, Cahoom. Oh, ah, Cahoom. Oh. Cahoom. Yes. It's and cool or what? What is? <laughs> it is a really cool. It, it, it is an interactive game for everybody. Oh. And basically, uh, I prepare it myself, so this is going to be harder because okay. basically we'll be from the knowledge that we have until right now, and the knowledge that we'll have next coming week. Okay. So you have two choices. And you don't uh -huh. know what am I going to ask, okay? Uh -huh. No, it will be, you have two choices. You can study or you cannot study. It's up to you. <laughs> okay? okay. So, so you better study, right? Nah, it's not, I do not make it complicated, but I do make it tricky. Mm -hmm. Yeah? I make it tricky. I got to let you know. And I really focus on grammar. So mm. you can say, for example, this sentence is right. But you did, yeah. But you forgot, or you didn't see that it was missing the comma, or it was missing the dot at the end of the mm -hmm. sentence, right? So mm -hmm. even okay. though it seems good, but if you forgot that, it's not good. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I can make a tricky. So you gotta pay attention. And you know what? That game, you don't have forever to to play it. You have few seconds to watch the mm -hmm. the the question. You, to get the possible answers and to answer it. If you got it good, okay. if you don't, sorry. That's really, <laughs> that is a really nice job. You cannot imagine, you will love it. Mm, all really all my groups love that. I, they're called Kahoot. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Okay, or it could, you know what? Or it could be a game for something that is not directly related to our topics, but it's maybe it's a grammar tense that we need to double check. So okay. you don't know what am I going to ask you, but you got to study, okay? Yeah, I'm letting you know, you know that in advance, okay? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Okay. You cannot. You don't know how to. What can you expect from me, okay? 
Okay, okay. I'm a Felix the cat bag. But in, mm -hmm. in English knowledge, so you don't know what you're going to get out of the bag. Out of the knowledge bag. Okay. Okay. I don't want to scare you guys. Okay, Janet, I don't want to scare you. <laughs> Where is Janet? <laughs> she left. Oh my God, just yeah. a bad like, oh. yeah. <laughs> No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Okay, I have Yvette here. Felipe, how are you? It's so nice to have you back. Very good. Hi, teacher. Hey, good Felipe. Evening. Good evening. You look tired. I couldn't attend the class yesterday. Yeah, because, I understand. Uh, because I, I have many patients. Me, okay, yes, I understand your profession requires that. I do understand. But I'm really happy that you're here with us. I'm so happy. And so happy to see you. Okay, Guys, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Felipe. Remember that if you, can, if you have problems like Felipe because of your job or whatever, it, please always watch the, the list, the YouTube, okay? Always. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't know if you have it. And if you don't have it, I will send it to you, the link, the URL. Today, I see the video. You saw it? Okay. So you will be in the same page, okay? And you're not going to, to miss something. Because and today, the and exactly. Yeah, and if you can, guys, advance in the platform exercise, that would be awesome, okay? And if you have any oh, questions, right. of course, I'll be more than glad to do it. Right now, you will be able to... Uh, after today's class, you will be able to do the whole exercise for the first week. Okay. Yeah. At least the section mm -hmm. one, you will be able to do it. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Yes. You, you, I want you to to go on the same page, right? And if you have any questions, feel free to send me a message. I will be. I'm not gonna ask answer you right away because maybe I will be busy or doing doing something else in my job, right? But as soon as I'm able to, I will answer you. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Hey, so, thanks. I, very good. Okay, guys, does it you remember? Do you remember the time? No. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I love Michael Jackson. Okay. No. So, do you remember, guys, that yesterday we were practicing, right? About yeah. some information. And you were supposed, like, really beautiful students that you are, to practice the dialogue, right? If I'm not yeah. mistaken. Okay. Mm -hmm. Because but you don't know, help, but yeah, <laughs> exactly. So you don't know which are going to be the big team. Sorry, and the participants for today's <laughs> class. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Okay. So Tati, hello, <laughs> hello, good Tati. Good evening. How are you, girl? A little bit tired. <laughs> A little bit. Yeah, you look tired, girl. I know that, but I'm so happy that you're here. Yeah. I'm so so happy to see you. So we're going to pick our first victim. Sorry, our first egg uh, pairs, I know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and let me double check. Tati, would you like to be the hair salon girl? Yeah, it's okay. Okay. <laughs> Angel. Yeah. My man, Angel. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Would Go you on. like to be the, the man who's supposed to call into the perfect, perfect, <laughs> egg, perfect. travel agent office? Yeah, perfect. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so okay. we're going to start. Yeah. Just, just, just let me put my, my eyeglasses. Uh, yes. Okay, your glass. Oh, of course, of course. The helpers. Yeah. <laughs> okay, no problem. I got it. Just wait a minute, please. Wait a minute. Okay. Okay, okay, all right. All right. Okay, so I need some information as scenario number five. Action, go ahead. Hello. Oh, hello. I need some information. What's the currency is used in the Europe, uh, European Union? Where? European Union. I think the euro is used is is used in most of Europe. All right, and is English spoken much there? I really have no idea. Oh well, what about the credit cards? Are they accept they were everywhere? How how will I know? Well, uh, you are the travel agent, uh, aren't you? What? This is a hair salon. You have the wrong number. Very good. Excellent. <laughs> Great job. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah. I was nervous. <laughs> Bravo. Excellent job. Very good. Excellent. 
<laughs> All righty. Next participants. Uh, 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 Mr. Lester. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Would you like to, part uh, to practice our dialogue today? Yes, right? Okay. Yeah, of course. Okay, yeah. of course. Yes, you have to say yes. You don't have any, any choice. <laughs> All right. So, yes, okay. yes. <laughs> yes, sorry, yes. Okay, so we're going to practice. You're going to practice with Miss Yvette Siliazar. Am I pronouncing your last name correctly, Yvette? Siliazar, yes? Or Salazar? Or Siliazar? Siliazar. Oh, Siliazar. Okay, thank you, Yvette. So you're going to be... Um, the hair salon girl, and mm -hmm. Mr. Lester is going to be uh, the one who's going to ask for information. Hey, uh, do you have, both of you, do you have the information that I sent to the WhatsApp yesterday? Yes. Uh, yes, you do. One moment. Okay, take um, your time, no rush, Yvette. I, 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 I looking for the information. Okay, cool, take um, your time, no rush. Information. And you can use your cell phone if you want, just to make it a little bit real. My currency is using the European Union. Mm -hmm. Yes, Angel. You know, Angel is getting into deeply into the character. <laughs> the conversation. Yes, the conversation. Okay. I need some, some information. Okay. Okay, so I need some information as scenario number six. Action. Go ahead, David. You start. Hello. Oh, hello. I need some information. What currency is used in European Union? Where? The Euro European Union. I think the euro is used in most in Europe. All right. And is English spoken much there? I really have uh, no idea. <laughs> huh? Well, what about credit cards? Are they accepted everywhere? How will I know? Well, you are a travel agent, aren't you? What? This is hair sale. You have to grow number? Very good. Excellent. Very good. Excellent job. Yeah. Now, guys. We are going to practice once again the pronunciation of the questions and the pronunciation of some words, okay? All right. And okay. after that, Miss Yvette and Mr. Lester, because it's the first time that you practice, right? Yesterday, some of guys practiced that, and today they practice again, and you did it much better, so it's good. Okay, I, after we practice the pronunciation, Yvette and Lester will do it one more time. But, and, but a good job, guys. But I want you guys to try to get into the character, right? And if you want, Yvette, you can use like cell phone, hello, right? Like that. Okay. <laughs> so let's practice together. Repeat after me. Hello. 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 Oh, hello. hello. Oh, hello. I need some information. I need some information. What currency is used in the European <laughs> Union? What currency is used in the European Union? Where? 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 The European Union. The, the European, European Union. 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 I think the euro is used in most of Europe. I think the euro is used in most of Europe. All right. And is English spoken much there? All, All right. right. Is English then spoken then much there? there. Okay. I really there. have no idea. There. I really have no idea. Well, what about well, credit cards? What about, what about credit, credit, cards? credit cards? Are they accepted everywhere? Are they uh, accepted yes, yes, everywhere? everywhere. Accepted How would I know? Everywhere? How will I know? How would I know? How would I know? Well, How would I know? Well, you're a travel agent, yeah. aren't you? You're a travel agent, aren't you? Agent, aren't you? What? 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 This is a hair what? salon. You have the wrong number. This, this is, is a hair salon. 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 You, right. you have, have the right you have wrong number. number. You can say wrong. number on number, okay? Okay. No. All right. Number on number. And for me, it's fine. Okay, guys, do me a favor. 
Uh, go again to the to the dialogue and check the first question that Mr. John says when it says what currency is used in the European Union. Yeah, you see that? Yes. yes. Okay, guys. Uh, that one is start with a WH, right? WH. In English, yeah. guys, we got two type of questions. We got the WH questions, which is what, where, who, how, etc. Yeah. Uh -huh. Just, just a friend, you remind it. And we have the just no ah. question. Okay, so the WH question, guys, it is a it is called informative questions because yeah. I ask you to get more information. I don't want a simple yes. I don't want a simple no. I'm asking you information that I want to know. So the intonation of a WS question goes down. You don't say, what currency is used in the European Union? No, you said, what currency is used in the European Union? You see the intonation? What currency is used in the yeah. European Union? The intonation goes down, okay? Too high to low, okay. Exactly. But even though the intonation goes down, you still need to hear that they're asking you something. Not that they're saying something, because I can say, what currency is used in the European Union? You see, the pronunciation is flat. Yeah. I do not distinguish if it's a question, if it's something that come out of your mind or what. But if I said, what currency is used in the European Union? You see, Union is not loud, but it's still at the end, it sounds like if you're asking question, mm -hmm. okay? okay? And the intonation goes down. Okay, now let me go back to the, okay. Almost, ah, with the part of, of John that says, huh, well, that one. Mm -hmm. Are they accepted everywhere? Okay, that one, are they accepted everywhere? If you see guys, that is a uh, bird to be, right? Are they yeah. accepted everywhere? Okay. That is uh, a bird to be in simple present. So, that one show that is called guys just yes, no question mm -hmm. okay because if i ask you are they accepted everywhere you, you have two choices the, the, the direct answer to the question is yes, yes or no and then you can give me extra information if you wanted to but the just no question guys is a simple yes it's a simple no so the intonation is the opposite way the intonation goes up so you said, are they accepted everywhere? You see, are they accepted everywhere? You see, at the end, you emphasize a little bit and you go up. Are they accepted everywhere? It's different on the first question. What currency is used in the European Union? You see, what currency is used in the European Union? Are they accepted everywhere? Are they accepted everywhere? You see, you see the difference of the intonation? So yes. the WH question yes. goes down, but still you need to hear that you're asking something. And that just no question, the intonation goes up. But uh, still, you need to use, uh, hear that they're asking you a question and you need to allow, you don't allow to voice, okay? Because you're going to be scared of somebody, okay? No, are they accepted everywhere? Okay? okay. So I want you guys to remember that. Double this question, intonation goes down. Just no question, intonation goes up. Okay? okay. Uh, okay. Maybe I can ask in the Kahu. I don't know, but just to let you know, okay? in advance for future references. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so you see, okay guys, so I wanna clarify that because I want you guys to pronounce it correctly and to give the, the correct intonation of the questions, okay? So, okay, okay let's practice it again. Okay, Yvette. <laughs> okay, again, Yvette and Mr. Lester, let's listen to you one more time. Okay. You can use your hello. cell phone, Yvette, yes. Okay. Use your cell phone. Hello. Hello. Oh, hello. Hello. I need some information. What currency Ooh. is used in the European Union? Very good. Where? The European Union. I think the I think Euro is used in the most of Europe. All oh, right. And is English spoken much there? I really have no idea. Huh? Well, what about credit cards? Are they accepted everywhere? How? How I will I know? Mm -hmm. Well, 
you're a travel agent, aren't you? What? This is a hair salon. You're how wrong number? Very good. No, don't ask uh, Yvette. What? This is a hair salon. You have the wrong number. Yeah, like that. Yeah. Because at the end, it's an exclamation. It's not a question. So do it one more time. The last, the last sentence. The last sentence, Yvette. You can do it. What? Okay. What? This is a hair salon. You have done your house ground number. Very good. Much better. Excellent. This is a hair salon. A hair salon. You got hair the wrong salon. number. Mm -hmm. Okay. Again, you can do it. What? This is a hair salon. You have the ground number? No, you have the wrong number. This is not a question. It's, a, it's an exclamation. Again, you can do it. <laughs> okay. What? This is hair salon. You have the grand number. Very good. That's <laughs> what I need. Excellent job, my girl. Give me to a five. Excellent. And one more time. Uh, um, let me check. Lester, uh, when you said, well, you are a travel agent. No, agent. 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 Well, You're a travel agent, aren't you? Okay. Mm -hmm. well, so I'll do it one more time. Mm -hmm. Well, you are a travel agent, aren't you? Very good, excellent job, guys. This is uh, that that word. Uh, you are a travel agent, aren't you? You're going to see it later on, but we call in English that that kind of questions we call tag questions. Okay, that is the, those course tag questions. I'm not going to get into deeply that because I'm going to confuse you, but that's how it calls tag questions. Mm -hmm. Just to emphasize to emphasize what you have said. Okay, guys, so if you take a look on the dialogue, the first question, what currency is used in the European Union? That part, guys, is used in the European Union. That is a passive voice without buy. That is the first example. And there's another example here, the intervention of Kelly, when she said, I think the euro is used in most of Europe, that is another example of passive without buy, okay? That's why I ask you to read it because I want you to get used to it and I want you to, to know or to get to know how you can use a passive without buy in a regular daily basis. For example, but I'm gonna share right now my screen with you just for you to be clear, okay? Because today we're going to focus. We already started speaking guys and practice intonation, which is really good. Now, <clears throat> let's move on to grammar. I know that you love grammar by heart. I know, I know. And you will love mm -hmm. grammar with me, I promise. Okay, <laughs> but yes, uh -huh. you're right, Angel? My man, Angel? Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, guys, so, but I want you to make a, a, a brief, um, what can I say, recap. Okay, so bear with me for okay. a couple of minutes because I want you guys to be clear uh, the structure of passive with by and then the structure of passive without by. Okay, so yeah. uh, yes. Okay, so bear with me for a moment. I will share right now my screen. Hey, Mariana, how are you, girl? Hi, Mercy. Hi, Hi, teacher. So happy to have you here in today's class. Okay, guys. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much for coming. So. Take a look. Can you see my screen, guys? Yes? Uh, yes. Yeah. Okay. A little bit? Yeah, a little bit uh, bigger, please. Ah, you want a bigger? Like this? Yeah, yeah. Uh, not, not so much. It's a little, not too much. Little, not like so this? Much. Yes, yes, yes. Thank okay. you. Okay, cool. Okay, guys. So I just want you to just make a refresh about what we already have seen. Do you remember, guys, that the passive with buy, what is the structure? Remember, the pass of V, right? And the past part is about the verb, is that right? Yes. Yes, why guys? Because in the passes with by, we really care about a, well, what is the action or who did it, okay? Mm -hmm. But, so you have to remember this, okay? Why I ask you to remember this? Because, let me go back to the topic that we're gonna see today. There you go. Let me give a look to this one. Passive without buys. 
What is the difference here, guys? What is the first difference? Take a look. We're going to use the present of be. Mm -hmm. And we're continue using the past participle of the verb. Okay, so one of the main difference is that, that passive with by, we use the past verb to be and the past participle of the verse. Yeah. The passive without by, we need to use the verb to be in present tense and the past participle of the verse. I had to yeah. let you know that because this is out of the rule. Okay, doesn't follow the rules. For example, let me, I want you guys to pay attention on the left side where it says active. Okay, if you can see, guys, we have all the verbs in present. Is that right? Yeah. Okay, we got the verb use, the speak, and manufacture. Okay, yeah, who can cool. help me first read it? That first one. Okay, thank you, Angel. Can you please read the first one when the check is there? Yep. And they use they they use, use the euro. They mm -hmm. use the euro in most of Europe. Okay. Okay. What we emphasize, they. They. Who who is they, guys? The people the, who live in Europe, right? People, yeah, exactly. Okay, okay. In the active in the active sentence, guys, we really care about who, who in this case, who used this money. Okay, they. Right. They who the people that live in mm -hmm. Europe, uh, use the euro in most uh, of uh, Europe. Okay, very good. Okay, so in this case, use emphasize, guys. The person, which in this case is what? They, okay? They, exactly. Okay, very good. What about the second one? Uh, Felipe, can you please read it for me, the second sentence? Okay, the second. Yes, please. They speak English in many European countries. Okay, very good. So who is speaking English in many European countries, guys? The people who lives in Europe, yeah, right? In Europe. Exactly. Yes. So it's still, guys, uh, the the verb emphasize on the people that lives there. They, we said they, the European guys, the European uh, people, okay? But it still is in present. Let me double check about the last one. Uh, Tati, can you please read for me the last sentence? Why always the most difficult? It's not difficult. Come on, Tati. No. no. <laughs> Yes. Okay, do your best. Uh, they manufacture a lot of cars in Europe. Very good. And very good for the pronunciation of a lot of. Okay, very good. Yeah. Okay, so you see, guys, so you see that, you see everybody. They, of <laughs> course, the people who live in Europe, manufactures a lot of cars. Okay, yeah. so you, so okay, guys, in the active way, <clears throat> a verb basically emphasize know the the euro know the language english know the fabrication of cars the verbs emphasize the people that lives in europe okay they yeah. use they speak they it's manufacture the most of you. but if that information changed completely if we want to translate the same information but use it passive so do me a favor now, let's move your eyes to the passive section. Okay. Okay, here you go. Uh, passive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Angel, read for me the yeah. first sentence, please. Okay, the arrow is used in the most of Europe. Okay, the arrow yes. is used in the most of Europe. If you see, guys, we have the verb to be and we have yeah. the past participle, past right? Possible. Yeah. Why is ED, guys? It's participle. Exactly, it's past participle. And what kind of verb it is? Is it regular or irregular? Regular. 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 Exactly. But pay attention to the sentences, guys. I'm not going. To, I'm not going to give you it right now the answer because I want you to to try to get it from yourself. Uh, okay. Let me check. Mm -mm -mm. Who wants to participate? Let me check. Mm -mm. Johnny, can you read sentence number two, please, for me? 
English is spoken in many European countries. Very good. English is spoken in many European countries. Very good. And last but not least, let me check. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Janet, can you please read for me the last sentence? Okay. A lot of cars are manufactured in Europe. Are a lot Europe. of cars are manufactured in Europe. 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 Remember the rock uh, group, Europe? Like the one that says, -na -na -na. Europe. Ta -na -na -na. <laughs> that one. Final exactly. <laughs> exactly. It's the final countdown, right? Remember that? Yeah. I know that song by heart. Okay. Uh, <laughs> That's really one one. Uh, 80s were phenomenal, right? Yeah. Okay, but they disappear, so. Okay, guys. <laughs> but take a look. <laughs> take a look, guys, at the sentence. In the active way, uh, let's read the first sentence active way and then read the first sentence in passive way, okay? Yes. Listen carefully. They use the Europe in most of the Europe, okay? In the first sentence, we emphasize or we put that the people in Europe, we use a the pronoun, right? They use their Europe yeah. in the Europe. However, let's read this sentence in a passive way. We move, right? We emphasize not the people. We emphasize the currency, the right? Currency. Yeah. So we say the euro is used in most of Europe. Yes, uh, most of Europe. Hey guys, what I have done or what I have taken out from the active sentence to the passive sentence? The, the first part when they speak about they, Exactly. Why? Because uh, in the passive way, guys, uh, it is no necessary to put who. Who is the person that do it? The oh, doer yeah. in this case, because uh, uh, there are two. Uh, there are two reasons why, or we don't care, or it's obvious. Okay. Yeah. For example. Uh, let me give you an example right now and uh, let me put it here. Let me raise this one. Oh, that's what noise is that? I don't know. Okay, okay, that's good. I already did. Okay, guys, so for example, let's pretend that we put right a um the the word by by just an hypothesis. So Let's put that, okay. Okay, for example, right guys? Okay, we said that Euro is used in most of Europe. And who use the Euro, guys? The, the European people. guys, the right? Europeans. Exactly, yeah. so because that is really obvious, right? We don't use it, we don't put it. We don't put the person who do it. Because, or if it's obvious, or it doesn't matter, mm -hmm. okay? For example, it's obvious that, if you see, so you can like take it out. You can say yeah. the, Euro, the Euro is used in most of Europe by the European people. Or you can say the Euro is used in most of Europe and that's it, okay? Mm -hmm. So in this case, uh, without buy guys, we do not put the doer. Because as I said, is it obvious or it doesn't matter, okay? For example, the second sentence. Uh, let me check who can help me read it. Uh, 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 uh. Mr. Ale Alex Cornejo, please. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm sorry. Very good. I'm sorry, which one are you say? The second sentence for the passive way, please. For the passive way. Oh, uh, the English is spoken in many uh, European countries. Very good, in many European countries. So we know, guys, that if English is spoken in many European countries, by who? European. European. By the European people. people. Exactly. So it, because it's obvious, we don't put it. We don't use the by. Because mm -hmm. what, we, what we really care is not who does the action in the passive way. We really care the object, in this case, that English is spoken. That is mm -hmm. what we really care, okay? Know yeah. who speaks, okay? Okay, and last but not least, a lot of the cars are manufactured in Europe. Okay, so what we really care? 
that a lot yeah. of cars are manufactured, yeah. right? By who? By the manufacturers. For the manufacturers in Europe. You see? You see how is it different? Yes. Yeah, is it really easy peasy queasy, right, guys? <laughs> ah, who said um, <laughs> okay? Is it easy? Is it easy? If you see, it's not complicated. No. All that you gotta remember is that uh, passive with by, you gotta use the verb to be in the past and the past participle of the verb. And yeah. in that particular sentence, the door is important. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, exactly. For example, um, in the active, in the act, in the active, and in the passive. <laughs> but mm -hmm. um, uh, the passive without by, uh, if you translate it into the passive way. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter who did the action because, first of all, we don't care. Or second of all, it's really obvious. Okay? Mm -hmm. That is not necessary to say it. But you got to remember that when you translate it, in, if it's active in the passive without by, the verbs corresponds to the subject and they have to be in present. And when mm -hmm. you translate it into passive way, you were going to use the present tense of the verb to be, which in this case is is or are, and the past participle of the verb. Okay? okay. That is all that you got to remember. Okay. So okay. that's why, that's why, guys, I make a review, because I want you to compare, which is the, uh, the structure and also the grammar between passive with by and passive without by. Okay? So okay. that's why. I know. I, I, you see that you're going to love grammar with me? It's, it's not complicated, right? It's not. Yeah, it's nice. It, it is easy. For example, you can say, um, Spanish is spoken in many Latin countries, right? Yeah. Or, many La or many countries in South America, right? You guys have that. And you are using pa passive without by. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When you want yes. to describe something. Okay. Or for, you can say, pupusas is the most traditional Important. eaten Operation. food in El Salvador. Right? Yeah. You see? That it yeah. helps us to make this description. And we don't care about the Salvadorian uh, eat it. We care about the pupusas. Right? Mm -hmm. Is there a yeah. difference? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh huh. Who said? Uh huh. Uh -huh. Like, angel. Hmm. Mr. Angel, right? <laughs> hey, there's a song about angel. <laughs> yeah, I, I, yeah, I remember that. Okay, I'm going to remember. So let's practice our writing, right? Because it's really different to speak and to write. Mm -hmm. okay. 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 So I'm, it will be nice. Don't worry about it. I don't know why you're scared, right, um, Janet? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me send it to you guys. Okay. And please let me know as soon as you're able to receive it. Exactly. You're right. <laughs> there you go. It's going to be really easy, busy, quizzy. Okay. Okay. I send it to you right now. <laughs> Basically, guys, this is a paragraph. And yeah. you need to complete the passage using the simple present passive form, what we have seen right now. And how you're going to use it, you don't have to invent the verbs. The verbs are there already. All that you got to remember is that you're going to use the present of, of verb to be, either is or are. And the past participle of the verb in parentheses. Okay? So don't worry about it. This is what we're going to do. I'm going to help you. I'm going to be nice. And we're going to work as a pairs, okay? Or no, no, we're going to make a, a like a trios. Okay, so bear with okay. me for a moment. Let's put let's practice together. Okay, don't worry. Let me check. Mm -mm. We are 19 because you you cannot count me. How many groups we can do? Who is really good in math right now? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Three, six, three. 
Six group. And, no, five. Five. All right. One will be for three and one will be for four, right? Yeah. Yes. Let me check. So let me double check. I'm going to assign Mr. Alejandro Pliteza, Ms. Beatriz, uh, Mr. Felipe. It will be one. Alex, Rachel, and Iris will be in the other one. Angel, Yvette, yeah. and Juancito will be in another one. Janet, Lester, and Mariana will be in another one. Who? Let me check. Mercy, Michael, Noria, and Kike will be in another one. There you go. Are you missing somebody? Do I miss somebody? Yes, right? I think so. There you go. Yes. Okay, here. I can put a Raphael here. I'll put Tati here. Mm -hmm. And then I will put Johnny here. Okay. Accept the invitation, please. Yep. Cool. Let's work together. Let's help each other. Okay, Tati, accept the invitation, please. Hello. Okay, guys, do you understand what you're going to do? Mm, not really. <laughs> not really. Okay, that's why I came back, because I just wanted to double check that everything is okay. Okay, Alejandro, this is what we are going to do. This is a short paragraph, right? It's a short paragraph. Okay. So, there's a spaces that we need to complete, to complete, right? To complete. Is that right? Mm -hmm. okay. So, so those spaces you're going to complete with the verbs that are in parentheses. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. And the verbs that are in parentheses, remember that we have seen passive voice without by. So when mm -hmm. you, you translate the passive voice without by, you have to remember that we need to use the simple present of the verb to be. Okay. okay. And mm -hmm. the past participle of the verb that is in parentheses. For example, let me give you a first example, okay, just to help you. You said many crops, many crops, Crop. parentheses grown in Taiwan, right? So you mm -hmm. said many crops, crops, singular or plural? Plural. So is is or are? Are. Are, okay, very good. And what is the past participle of grow? Grown. Grown. So you said grown. many crops Taiwan. are grown in Taiwan, okay? okay? That's what you gotta do with all the information. Okay. Is it easy? It's really easy, peasy, queasy. <laughs> okay, <laughs> very you. good job. Thank Continue, you. you're doing an excellent job, guys. Okay, thank okay. you. Okay, do you understand what you're gonna do, guys? Yeah. Yeah, okay, are you sure? Yeah? Yeah, yeah of course. We use, we use the simple present and in the past, you are in, in past participle. The, uh -huh. Of the verse in parentheses. The verse in parentheses, yeah. Oh, 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 excuse me, Dr. Lester. My apologies. <laughs> <No, laughs> I'm just teasing, yeah. All <laughs> right. Very good, guys. Continue, okay? You're doing an excellent job. So it's just like that. <laughs> Don't remember yeah. what happened. Uh, the verb grow. Ah, remember. Grow, grew, grow. grown. Grown. Oh, grown. Okay. Grown. So... Is grown or in, are grown? In this are. case, are. are grown. Are, yeah. exactly, because we're talking about plural, right? About yes. plural. Exactly. Yeah. So that is what you have to do. It's not complicated, in the, right? In yeah. the second song, I'm going to give you the answer. Awesome. <laughs> okay. Okay, continue. You're doing an excellent job, guys. Thanks, thanks, thanks. Buddy. Okay, do you understand what we're gonna do, guys? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Um, I think. <laughs> you think? Okay, what do you think, Marianita? Okay. Um, we have to add is oh. or are mm -hmm. if the verb is, is in plural or in singular. Uh huh, exactly. Plus the past participle the past participle parentheses. Of the word. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. For example, I mean, the first one. ED. Uh, mm. Depends. 
the crows are are or, or is the first many sentence crops, crops many crops are are exactly are, and then the word we have in parentheses is grow right so what is the past yes. participle of grow grown grown very grown. good exactly grown. so that's what many you're gonna crops do are grown in taiwan exactly very some good job crops some crops are is consumed are consumed locally consumed Sometimes you, are, you have to double check uh -huh, if it's regular or irregular. Yes, exactly. Consume. Okay. Consume. Exactly. Locally. Good job. You have to add it. Excellent but, job. Let me do what you press, okay? I'll be right back with you. Okay. Thank you. Okay. How is everything going? Michael, Norita, Mercy, Kike? Is everything okay? Hi, teacher. Hi. Yes, teacher. Yes? Of course, Hello, I teacher. know. You're smart guys. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Any questions so far? Is it good? Wait. Did you finish already? No. no well, yes. Not, not already. Ah, no. Okay, okay, okay. I will give you, um, I Wait. think, two minutes more. Okay. Okay. I'll be right back. 20 minutes. 20 minutes. No way, Kiki. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Okay. She's in my English <laughs> class right now. She speaks English, you know? Yeah, really? Yeah, she does. <laughs> she understands. <laughs> and they also and it's my pets a, also understand pe French as well. Mm -hmm. It's okay. a she? Huh? Yes, it's, it's a girl. A she? Oh. What's her name? Chloe Marie. Mm. It's sophisticated French. one. Oh, yes, it's French. <laughs> Mm. Uh, in Spanish, it's Claudia Maria. <laughs> 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 yeah, exactly. Hey, yeah, 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 my Spanish is getting better. You have to congratulate me, please. Come on. Congratulations. Uh, thank you. I know that it was not sincere, but that's okay. <laughs> Did you finish? Okay. Yes, right? Uh, almost. Almost. Okay, let's go okay. back. Excellent. Okay. okay, it's time to come back. Okay, don't worry if you have not finished. Just okay. did your best. Okay. Okay. We do have Alejandro. We do have Beatrice, uh, Janet, Mr. Felipe. There you go. <laughs> hey. Don't worry if you haven't finished, okay? That's great. Don't worry about that. That's part of the process. Okay, we've got to wait the rest and they need to hurry up. So I'm going to ask them to come back, boys. Okay. Mm -hmm. I don't know why they don't want to come back to say, hey, no, no way. It's still time for class. There you go. Come back, boys. Aha, you see? That message works. Everybody's coming back. Mm hmm. Uh huh, Mr. Herrera. I have Mr. Lester Cruz, Danny, Alex, Noria, Angel, Juancito. Very good, Lester. Uh -huh. I have, I always have to send a message, right? Come back, guys, right? You know, you do not come back. Ha, come on. Hmm. Okay, so this is what we're going to do, guys. Uh, we're going to, somebody will start uh, talking, reading the first sentence. Then I'm going to interrupt and I'm going to ask somebody else to continue. So this is what I'm going to do. You don't know who, who you, I'm going to ask somebody to continue, okay? For example, Janet could yeah. start reading and then I will ask, Lester, you continue. And then Felipe, you continue. And then Rafael, you continue. Then Tati and so on. So you need to pay attention if I, may, if I mention your name. Hmm. This is going to be a game. Okay, if, you, okay. if you do not answer right away, you're going to be out of the game, okay? All right. Okay, my dog entry and he pulled up the door. Okay. <laughs> okay, so, ready guys? No. Okay, sorry, that <laughs> No yet, teacher, no yet. No yet, no, okay. Uh, it's just a part of In five minutes, in five minutes. No, in five, in five no minutes. Kike, that's not possible. All right, so. Please. Three minutes, no, it's enough time. At 10 p.m. 
<laughs> no, uh, yes, and we already finished classes. No way. Okay. <laughs> tomorrow. Uh, uh, no, we don't have classes tomorrow, Tati. <laughs> <laughs> if you were in on the weekend. If, no way, we don't have classes on weekends, right? So from Monday to Thursday. Weekends off. Okay. In WhatsApp. Into the WhatsApp. No way, Tati. Okay, Tati, you want to start? No. <laughs> uh -huh. mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, yeah. 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 No, Kike will start. Okay, Kike, first one. Go ahead. Many crops are grown in Taiwan. Okay, continue, Tati. Oh, you lose, Tati. Sorry. Okay, sorry. Continue, Alejandro. Alejandro, continue. Okay, uh, some crops are consumed locally, but others are exported. Very good. Uh, continue, Alex. Teas are grown. Teas yeah, are grown? I'm sorry, yeah. Tea are grown in a cooler, cooler parts of the island. Aha. Uh -huh. Continue. And, and, and rice, I'm sorry. And rice is cultivated in a warmer parts. In warmer parts, okay, continue, Beatriz. Fishing mm -hmm. is also an important industry. Continue, Rafael. Um, a wide variety of seafood are catched and mm -hmm. are shipped all over the world. Okay, and finish it with that, Mariana. Many people are employed in the electronics and textile industries as well. Okay, very good, excellent. Okay, guys, only in the part T, Mr. Alex, T yes. is grown. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. that's what I said. I, I, heard, I heard you said are grown. Wrong. The first one was I said. Uh -huh, aha, right. Uh -huh. but, but, oh, you, okay. <laughs> you correct yourself. You, okay, very you good. <laughs> okay, let's practice some uh, pronunciation, okay? Repeat after me Please. crops. Crops. Export. 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 Cooler. Cooler. Island. Island. Cultivate. Cultivate. Warmer parts. Warmer parts. Important. Important. A wide. A wide. Variety. Priority. 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 Of seafood. Of seafood. Of seafood. No, 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 no. Of no. seafood. Not of. Of seafood. Of seafood. Of seafood. Of seafood. Catch. 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 All over the world. All over the world. All over the world. The world. All over the world. Textile industries. Textile industries. Okay, guys, I want you guys to look at my face because okay. right now I will pronounce it once again and I want you guys to also try to pronounce it as, as far as I do. Why? Okay. Because as I explained to you in the beginning of, um, of our course, if you would like to tr uh, try to pronounce it correct, sometimes you have to exaggerate your facial expressions, okay? Yeah, yeah. So, mm. so your muscles can get used to the pronunciation. Once mm. they get used to it, they will come up easily and you don't have to exaggerate. But at the first time mm. you have to, all right? So yeah. mm -hmm. let's look at my face and look at my mouth and my lips. Crops. Crops. Consume. Consume. Luckily. Export. Export. Cooler. Cooler. Look at that. Look at that. Cooler. 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 Island. 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 Cultivate. 
Cultivate. Cultivate. Warmer. Warmer. No Walmart. Warmer. Warmer. Important. Important. Industry. 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 A wide. A wide. A wide. Variety. Variety. Of. Of. Seafood. Seafood. Catch. 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 Chip. Catch. All over the world. All over the world. All over the world. Very good. All the world. Textile industries. Very good. Okay, I know. Maybe today you will like, oh my God, why my cheeks are hurting so much? <laughs> ah. You were like, am, right? Yeah, you have to do a massage here. Mm -hmm. Yes, but... I know. But if you if you do exactly that scene, you know like that it may, next time you will pronounce it much better. You're not going to yeah. say, mm -hmm. you're yeah. going to say the crops. You're going to say consume, crops. export, mm -hmm. uh, cooler, Warmer, uh, island, cultivated, uh, 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 a wide variety of food or seafood, you see, variety, variety, and textile industries, you see, I do not open my mouth, textile industries, variety, because my, my mouth is already used to that pronunciation, so if you do that in all the worlds, at, at the end, your facial mouth will get used to the pronunciation, they will come up easily. Yeah. Yeah. Teacher, yes. I have a question. No. Okay, Marian. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> good night. <laughs> That's amazing. Okay, good. Go ahead. When we pronounce the ed at the end of the word, it has to sound like a t. Depends. Okay. That's that. That's what I'm going to send it to you this uh, this weekend, guys. Besides the tongue twister, the first tongue twister. Okay. okay. Uh, the the re the regular verbs. All of them ends in ed, but mm -hmm. not all of them is pronounced the same way. Okay. Actually, we got three character, three um, we Voice. can say qualifications. Oh, oh. yes, uh huh. You can pronounce it like ended in id, also pronounce it like d, and also pronounce it like t termination. So we have three categories. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is to try to send it to you that I like a video or something that will explain it to you. Uh, it will be a little a little bit long video, but it's really important that you get to know that and just to make a refresh. Mm -hmm. And yeah. we're going to start with one tongue twister that is not going to be complicated. It's shorter, mm -hmm. but sometimes they mix two two sounds. They mix they mix like s sound with a sh sound. Okay. Sometimes mm -hmm. you need to. It is really hard to. Uh, to jump from one sound to another. Yes. For example, you can say seashells from seashells by the seashore, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. So first you like, then sh, 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 sh. okay? So it's short, but we're going to practice that S sound with a sh sound, okay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Angel. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, have a, I have a doubt. What um, doubt do you have, sir? Uh, oh, in Ali, the part yes. of uh, in the part of the paragraph that say catch and ship, we have to put R two times or just one. Uh, ah. No, only one. Catch only one. Mm -hmm. okay. You cannot say R catch and R chip. No, only one. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. And Thank guys. You. You need to also remember something because there are some verbs that depends on the termination, you double the last letter. All right. you, know, yeah. you, you don't have to forget that, right? 
Yeah. There are some verbs that you double the D. There are some verbs that you double the P at the end of the sentence. There, is, there are some rules. If yeah. you do not remember, I will also try to send it to you, okay? Please. Yes, please. for future yeah. references. Yeah. <laughs> okay, any doubts, any questions, guys? So far, so good? Easy peasy queasy? Yeah. 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 A piece of cake. A piece of cake, right, Iris? Yes. I, had a, I had a question, teacher. Go ahead, Rene. Refer, sorry, Rafael. Yeah, but it's, it's not as. Yes, I don't do ah, so you know, I'm not going to answer that. Okay. <laughs> No, uh, how long how long is it going to take this course? How long is it going to take? How long is it going to take, guys? One month. A month. Uh, a month. month. Okay. For a week. Okay. Four weeks. I okay, know I that it. it. it's just the first week. Come on, Rafael. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I, 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 I think it, I it, made... It's another way of, uh, uh, it's a polite <laughs> way to say, you know what, teacher? I don't want you. Just I want to change it, you know? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> yeah, really. just teasing you, Rafael. Because, uh, yeah, okay, thank you. Yeah, because I don't know, uh, I think I miss the part that when you say how long it's going to take, that's what I asked. Uh -huh. <laughs> Did I ask something? No. no. Okay. I, I don't understand that why you ask, Rafael. Sorry. No, like, um, I think it, uh, I, um, I miss, I think I miss, and I don't know if you say at the start, at the beginning of the course. Uh, no, I didn't. Ah, okay. No, I didn't, I didn't. No, but okay. that's good. But you know what? We already have passed the first week. Yeah. Yeah, right? Time passed really fast. Magic. You will yeah. see. Yeah. No, I mean, the first week uh, uh, to have an English class. Yeah. <laughs> of course. We're still waiting for Friday and weekends, right? Yeah. But you will see, guys, that uh, when you have no notice about it, we will be having our last class. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So time passed you. really, really passed. And hopefully you, yeah. you will miss me tomorrow. Okay, thank yeah. you. Oh, yes, teacher. Oh, nice, Alec. You're gonna Very make me cry. Oh. No, 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 no. no, but no, but you're not gonna miss me because even though I'm not going to be physically present, I will be like WhatsAppingly it's, present. Okay. All right. We, we learn a lot, you know. Well, I'm trying to do my best to share what I know, and also I let a lot of you guys as well. Yeah, so really you're well. going to be yeah. my Spanish uh, teacher, right? Right. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> yeah, so we can share, you know. I know yeah. Spanish, I speak Spanish, but sometimes there are some words that I don't know. For example, you know what? I remember, just take a sneak peek. We're almost gone, guys. We're almost gone. But um, I remember <laughs> that worry, yeah, tomorrow, once I went to uh, 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 to the a part of Insta where I went to the uh, airport to give classes to a specific group there in the airport. And um, I heard a girl, when they came up from, to the classroom, they said, you got a charle agua, a charte agua. <laughs> I was like, Does it, because the airport, you know what? That sun is really hot. So I said, maybe they're yeah. really, they're, maybe this hot. So all the one I buy is a charte agua, right? <laughs> well, yeah, oh. yeah in, in my innocent mind, right? So. <laughs> When, when I figured out what they were talking about, they were talking oh about God, another, another guy that they, not, that they like. So chatagua means like, relax, girl, okay? Take it easy. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, when I figured it out, like, oh, you didn't know that expression. So I, like, you know what? I wrote it down. That mm -hmm. is it's, um, one extra phrase or expression to my Spanish vocabulary, right? <laughs> yeah. And from right now on, when they said that, ah, I know what they were talking about. <laughs> like a girl and like a boy you count down okay like yeah, that oh, so cool her down exactly so but i didn't yeah. know i i took yeah. it literally right. yeah, like maybe she needs to refresh a little bit okay? <laughs> yeah but i didn't know so that's that's why i let you know guys that you're going to be my spanish teacher and i'm going to be your english teacher Deal? Okay. Deal. Deal. Okay, very good. Okay, guys. So once again, thank you so much for being in today's class. It's the last uh, But I have a day. question. Oh my goodness. Okay, Janet, go ahead. I what wanna leave, but I'm sorry section? because it because of Janet, okay? Right. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. What is the section okay. that we need finish in the platform? Well, the first one, the section number one. Okay. okay. Section, yes, uh, by the end of the of the week, you you are able to to finish all the section number one. Okay. Because okay. next week okay. we're going to start section number two. Okay. 
Okay. okay. And if you have any questions, guys, regarding any activities for the platform, we can double check it in class. Or if you have a specific question, you can send me a message. I'm not gonna answer you like quite um, fast because maybe I will be in my other job. Uh, but as soon as you are able to do it, I will be more than glad to answer, okay? okay. I, I, I'm, okay. You can reach me anytime, but I'm not 24 seven, okay? <laughs> you, know, you know what? Why? Because I had a, I was student once in a while that he took it literally, and he was sending me a message at oh, eleven God. fifty-seven p.m. Oh, and I was like, "What? <laughs> he nuts or what?" I'm not, I didn't answer him because you can you imagine. So that's why I'm willing to help you, but don't take it literally, okay? I'm okay. Okay. Sure. okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay. Have a nice night. Bye bye and great weekend, guys. Bye. Bye. You too. Bye bye. 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 Good night.